Hi, I'm Ben, and this is, yeah, sorry if I have been doing videos for like three weeks or something, um, but, yeah, I, I just haven't found anything to review or talk about yet, because Fiona and Cake wrapped up, and I, ru I heard rumors they might make a season two if this does well, and I heard it is doing well, so I don't know if they will make a season two, but only time will pass. Some people, th I think, want me to review the Five Nights at Freddy's movie, but I'm living with my mom, so I can't really, r really, and my mom's not feeling her best, and she only wants, and she only wants to see certain, some certain movies, but I'll review it some other time. But yeah, I, and some people are probably expecting me to review the Marvels, but my mom's not feeling her best, so I'll review it when I'm next week with when I'm with my dad so I know what you're thinking Ben you're a grown ass you're a grown man why don't you just go by yourself well I have Asperger's syndrome and my mom won't trust me but she doesn't trust other people and she's worried something might happen so I'm sorry if I'm telling you this story it might sound kind of embarrassing but I hope you'll understand but I'll, I'll see the marvels eventually so what video am I gonna do um well i guess if you saw the thumbnail or or even the title i'm going to review i'm going to talk about some new lego sets that are coming out i don't often review lego sets like like if anything i should really talk about those sonic the hedgehog sets like they released a new lego shadow that i really want to get but you know i'll review I should review Lego Sonic, like I did a video for Lego Mario, and I was really, because I always wanted Lego Mario, but the only Lego Sonic sets we got were the idea sets and Lego Dimensions, and now we're getting full Lego Sonic sets. I, I'll do another video for another time, but this one I want to talk about are some Lego Marvel sets. The ones I really want to bring up is one that says Lego versus Lego Spider-Man versus Sandman Final Battle. Now what could that mean? Like, because it says Final Battle, so if this was going to be an original set, it wouldn't make any sense to call it Final Battle. Like, it has to connect to something. It's probably the Sandman final battle at the New York and Spider-Man No Way Home. Like, it's probably a, a Spider-Man No Way Home set, because I love Spider-Man No Way Home, and that would be a cool thing. And Sandman wasn't exactly in the No Way Home set, so I think making them a Sandman set for No Way Home might make sense a bit because he wasn't exactly in the official No Way Home Final Battle set, so this was probably a, a Sandman set dedicated to him. But wouldn't it be cool if they make uh make Lego sets for the PS the PlayStation games like the Insomnia games? Yeah, because I, I actually, sorry if I haven't done any videos for it, but I thought I should do a full review for the game since it's out now, but I haven't played the game yet because I don't own a PS5 and it hasn't came on Steam yet and I don't have the money for it, but I'll review it when I'll review it. But yeah, I heard Sandman is in it. I wonder if they, I wonder if he opened the bottle like in those pat pack stage levels in the first game, so... I don't know what, how did Sandman got into this. Don't tell me any spoilers, but that would be cool if they make a, a Lego set based off the Spider-Man game set. Or here's an idea. Wouldn't it be cool if they... Because another final set I can think of with Sandman is Spider-Man 3. Wouldn't it be cool if they made Lego sets based off the old Sam Raimi movies Spider-Man 3? Because think about it. They made the first two into the being the first two lego spider-man sets back in the early 2000s i remember growing up as a kid with those lego sets i i owned the first film studio set and the green goblin set but i never got any of the spider-man 2 sets which is too bad because i really wanted those but when because they lost the rights in the mid 2000s and they went to make a blocks but wouldn't it be cool if they made Lego Spider-Man 3 movie sets based off the old Sam Raimi movies. I would love that. That would be awesome. But I don't know if they'll do that. Because chances are it, it might be home, No Way Home. Because 
That's the only rights we'll get, but we'll have to see. And anyways, um, and be it, chances are it'll be Spider-Man No Way Home, or the, I don't know if it'll be the PlayStation game or the Spider-Man 3. That would be awesome because I'm sentimental to those movies, but we'll have to see and find out. I'll do a video when it comes out, but chances are it'll be, it'll be mostly No Way Home. But that would be awesome if it was the Insomnia game or Spider-Man 3, the, the Sam Raimi Spider-Man 3. But another one is one called Green Goblin Buildable. Now, I, and there's another one called Spider-Man Buildable Figure, which I already own. I own the big Spider-Man Buildable Figure, but this is another Spider-Man Buildable Figure. But what could that be? Because they already did Miles Morales. Oh, chances are, because they already did a comic version, so this might be, like, maybe a No Way Home version, like this. Maybe, like, the Iron Spider from, like, the MCU movies. Like, maybe a Spider-Man buildable figure from, like, the Sam Raimi movie, the MCU movies. We'll have to see. Or Scarlet Spider, I don't know. Like, or Otto Octavia Spider-Man, or, or even the PlayStation suit. I don't know if they have the rights to that, but that would be cool if they did try. I wish they could make Lego sets based off the Insomniac games. But yeah, I wonder what it could be. Another one is Green Goblin Buildable. Now, I don't know if this is a buildable figure. It could be a buildable something else, but chances are or they might make a buildable figure based off the comics. Or likely No Way Home, which could be cool. But how cool if they make a full Sam Raimi Lego buildable figure based off the Sam Raimi movies. Like, I know a lot of people think the mask is goofy. It's just, like I said before, I grew up with those old Spider-Man Lego sets. Like, from the film studios. So, it would mean so... And I actually own the Lego's Green Goblins figure. Um, I think I can show you. Yeah, so here's the spider, the Green Goblin figure from the, the Sam Raimi movie. I had this since I was a kid. And even the Sam Raimi, Tobey Maguire, Spider-Man figure. The original ones from the one I had, I also had when I was a kid. But I don't know if it will be based off the Sam Raimi movie. But that would be awesome. But Because it will mean so much to me as a kid. But... Chances are probably based off the comics or possibly No Way Home, but we'll have to see and find out. So, um, I guess that's it for these videos. Um, um, I'm really excited for these. I, I love Spider-Man. I, As you can see here, I own the big Spider-Man Lair figure set, and that would be so cool if I... If I... If the if they make those Lego sets, the Spider Man, Sandman, and Goblin, and other Spider Man figure, but we'll have to see what they will be like. So that's my video for this. I hope you all enjoy it, and see you next time. <laughs>